guys to the Spurgeon Piper. This is Wilson with you. Now if you followed my channel for a short period of time, uh, five or six months, you may have noticed that I have the same pipe lighter usually on hand. Um, especially if I'm in this area and I'm, I'm lighting a pipe or maybe it's sitting behind me. And that pipe lighter is Peterson's Old Boy style. Now I've had it well over a year. And uh, in fact, about a year ago I had a review on it that you can watch right now. Um, bear in mind, it's lower quality, but it does go through the basics of this pipe lighter, so uh, you can check it out if you desire to. Uh, but I've still had, had quite a bit of questions over it since then. Um, is it worth the price? Is it durable? Um, do you, have you had problems with it? And so I thought, hey, I would have a year review of this pipe lighter and give you my thoughts after using it quite a bit. So uh, let me just quickly go over some of the characteristics of it. I'm not going to go over everything. Um, you can watch that video I mentioned uh, to get more, but uh, basically it is the old boy style pipe lighter. These were, the, you know, their history goes back to the 20s. Um, they are a high quality pipe lighter. Um, so if you wanted to check on the prices of those, uh, there's various uh, manufacturers of them and, and, uh, and resellers, retail sellers of them. Uh, you can look at smokingpipes.com, which uh, has a, a variety of both brands and specifically at Peterson, they have a, a variety of styles of, of coverings and things like that that range in some prices from like $88 to $120 or so. At least that's as of June 2022. Um, and there are other manufacturers of old boy style pipe lighters, but this one I have here is was $88. And so it is on the pricier side of things. I've used pipe lighters of all sorts, from matches uh, to regular Bic lighters you can buy at the grocery store to uh, lighters you use for lighting candles, you know, the long stick can uh, lighters. Um, I've used some soft pipe lighters that you can buy that range from $10 to $15, $20, $35. Uh, and of course, I have used maybe more than that, a, a Zippo pipe lighter. And especially if I'm outside, that is usually one I'm going to stick with if I'm going to be outdoors for quite some time. But overall, I have stuck with this pipe lighter. And so I, I've been quite pleased with it, but let me go ahead and let you know um, a problem I did have. So on the bottom of it, you have your filling valve and your flame adjustments here. Now, at, after about six months of, of ownership, five months, um, I noticed that I could not adjust the flame any longer. Yes, I could screw and unscrew the flame adjuster, but it was a blowtorch pretty much the whole time until it ran out of fuel. And uh, so I had to send it in. Um, I'm not sure what, what the issue was, but I did send it in to smokingpipes.com, which is where I bought it from, and they fixed it free of charge. Um, it took a couple of months, but uh, I still got it back. I've had it for six months, five months, and hey, it's been fine. It's been working well. I've had no problems as of recently. So that was unexpected. That was disappointing. Um, $88, hey, that's that's a good chunk of change, at least for me, and um, I was hoping it would be a little longer lasting. But however, do I still recommend it? What am, what am I feeling about it? Uh, I'm still satisfied with this product, with this, with this pipe lighter. I think it's solid made. I think it's gonna last a very long time. Um, it'll probably be something I pass down uh, to someone else, to a child, uh, or what have you. It's an heirloom. Uh, it, it, it had a, an issue. Maybe it won't return. I don't know. Uh, but from other, uh, others who've, who've had these type of pipe lighters, they last a long time. Um, is, it, is it worth putting down $88? Well, it depends on what you're wanting. Is it needed? Absolutely not. Uh, you can use matches. Some still stick with matches, and they swear by matches. Just use matches. Um, I, for quite a long time, I used Bic lighters, and you can just stick with the Bic lighter. Or, now, I still use Zippo pipe lighters, and um, if you're getting into pipe uh, pipe smoking, I'd probably just point you to a, a, a Zippo pipe lighter, um, and, and specifically a pipe lighter, the Zippo insert, or excuse me, I said that backwards, the pipe insert of the Zippo lighter and uh, you can find those fairly easy and they range from like 13 to 20 dollars or so but really what I was wanting from in this pipe lighter was uh, style and durability 
in that soft flame. Uh, something to protect the the bowl of my pipe and so I wasn't charring it and that offers it very well. Um, it has a soft flame that I can adjust and be in quite care of my pipes and that does offer that. It's also style. Um, so there are other soft flame lighters out there that are cheaper but this has a retro style that stems back to the 20s and 30s and that is one reason to uh, to that, that, that many, including me, were drawn to them, um, is, is the style. They're more elegant um, than other things out there. So, uh, and saying all that, I, I still do recommend it. Um, I think the other needs of it uh, are, are quite easy to get, whether lighting, lighting fluid, um, that's pretty readily available. Um, it takes Zippo uh, flints, and so that's easy to get my hands on. I keep a lot of these on hand. You can buy them off Amazon or Smoking Pipes or your local tobacconist probably has these on hand as well. So in, in saying all that, I've had it a year and a half. I've had had this issue, uh, but I would still recommend it depending on who you are. For those of you who are veterans or you know you are stuck in the pipe smoking hobby, it has, it has you by the, by the tail or what have you, um, I, I think it can make a nice uh, addition to your, to your uh, pipe smoking regimen, um, especially if you're out in public or if you care about what it looks like or what have you. Hey, I, I think it's well worth it. I think it will be a long, long lasting piece uh, to your collection. If you don't care, then don't get it. Uh, if I didn't care at all, if I wasn't looking for a style, I would stick to my Zippo pipe lighter and, uh, and, and be satisfied, which I still use it often when I'm outside. So uh, there you have it. Uh, so yeah, I, I recommend them. There's other styles out there and you just need to pick what's best for you. I, I do like the Peterson. Um, I'm quite satisfied. And, uh, but there, there's quite a variety. You can find Karibi and Corona and, and some others. Uh, but uh, let me know your thoughts. If you have one, what do you think? Have you been disappointed? Are you satisfied? Um, what would you recommend for others? So, guys, if you have questions on this, feel free to leave them below. Leave your thoughts below. And uh, if I can help you anymore, I'm happy to do so. But that's all I have for today. I hope you are blessed. You're having a great week. And we will talk to you very soon.